Hey, I'm Derek Williams. I'm here with Cryotone Tubes. I'm going to be demoing the Cryotone 6v6 power tubes. Uh, I'm going to be comparing them against RCA's uh, vintage 6v6 power tubes and uh, JJ 6v6 power tubes. Um, I'm going to be using a Morgan Amps MV45 Master Volume Amp. Um, I've replaced the EL34s in that amp with 6v6s uh, and it totally rocks. Uh, I'm just going to dime the master volume and turn the preamp down um, and that way we can really hear the power tube distortion instead of the preamp tube distortion. Um, and I'm going to play a series of clips comparing the tubes and let your ears decide what you like better. All right, let's check it out. Uh, so, as you can hear, all the tubes sound really fantastic. Um, it might be difficult to hear those subtle differences, so uh, before we go any further, make sure that you're listening to this demo in high quality and that you're listening uh, on a good set of studio monitors or on a good set of in-ears or reference monitors that you're familiar with. So as you can hear, the JJ is a good sounding tube. Uh, it's a little bit imbalanced, it lacks the low end that the Wathen has. Uh, the Wathen is just oozing with mojo. It's a very balanced tube um, and there's a little bit more output uh, on it as well. Um, and then the uh, vintage RCA, great sounding tube. What can I say? It's a vintage RCA tube, you know? But it lacks the low end as well and it has more of a spike in the treble. Uh, you'll really be able to hear those differences in this next clip. I'm just going to be playing the old faithful G chord. So let's uh, listen for it and uh, see how it sounds. Great, so uh, you can hear uh, again that the JJ uh, lacks the low end, but it also lacks the output level that the Wathen has. Uh, the Wathen has a higher output, just a more rocking tube in general, uh, very balanced EQ, um, and you can hear the note separation uh, between all of the strings in the chord. So um, the Wathen's got my vote. Uh, third and final example, I'm going to be playing some single note melodies, just a little bit of blues riffing. Um, and listen for a couple of things here. Number one, how well the tube compresses. Um, when I spank it, does it give back? The compression, uh, the character of it, is it uh, a fast attack, a fast release, a slow release? How is it? Is it bouncy? Um, and uh, so let's just check it out. Here we go. So you can hear that uh, all the tubes sound really good, uh, but uh, the Wathen is just oozing with mojo. The rake up to that first F sharp has a lot of low end to it. Uh, and uh, it's, it's got just beautiful compression. It's a very fun tube to play. 
And uh, man, it just made, made my app come alive. Uh, I plan on putting uh, the Wathen Cryotone 6v6 tubes in all of my 6v6 amps. And honestly, I'm considering keeping the 6v6 tube in this Morgan EL34 amp because it just sounds better than the EL34s in my opinion. So, hey, do yourself a favor. If you own, you know, a $2,000 or $3,000 boutique amplifier and a $400 overdrive pedal, why wouldn't you spend another couple hundred bucks on getting some really good tubes? Check out Wathen Cryotone 6v6 tubes at wathenspeakers.com.